All right, y'all. Welcome back to another episode of y'all first episode of Smoke on the Street Club Reviews. How y'all feeling today? Chilling. Chilling, girl. Yeah, man. Tell the people who y'all is real quick. My name's Mish. I'm KP, artist named KP Dancing. All right, man. Today, <clears throat> we're going to be trying out some of this apple fritter that we got. We want to see what y'all feel about this, man. So, who wants to spark? Mm, you just gonna let the ladies do it first. Okay, hold on, hold on. You almost caught me with this jar. This jar almost fell already. <laughs> 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 well, I appreciate it. First, real quick, just off the look and smell before you even spark them. Off the look and smell. What do you guys, how you guys you know, feel about it? What's the rating? Off the look. Definitely big buzz, so that's a that's a green flag for me. Mm -hmm. I'm definitely gonna stay off the butt. And the smell may give it a butt eight, I ain't gonna lie. Okay. Very, very good. Um, I'm gonna give it a seven. Um, oh, just the look, I like the color. Um, yeah, it's not too bad. And off the smell, I like the smell. So doesn't smell like apple. Mm. <laughs> so more apple or more fruit? Not that sweet. It is like a sweet, like after food. Okay. Well, after smell. I said after food. But yeah. Right. Yeah, it's not bad. Okay. <laughs> All right, so when you guys do the honors and spark Sammy Dairy. Oh, shit. Is this not it? Yeah, you go. Big boy. Don't hmm? eat that. Don't eat that. Fat joint. For sure. <laughs> Skinny <laughs> <laughs> All right, off your first couple puffs. Have to taste them. I got gum in my mouth, so. Mm. Mm. <laughs> it's actually not bad. Mm -hmm. I can't explain the taste of it, but it's it's not a bad taste at all. Okay. It'll come to you. Let me get in and we'll start. Let we'll start hitting it. Kicking in. Yeah, it's a big guts. Hmm? It's a big hell. No, that's a big. I didn't realize how big it was until I like, picked it up. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. That joke doesn't taste like an apple. Is you the turn? That's sweet apple. You use the turn. Oh, I see that now. Yeah. So, yeah, it tastes like an apple? It's a little kid, dude. What, what, what red or green? <laughs> to my right or green? <laughs> Ain't no green, definitely not no green apple. Yeah, green like a sour apple, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. more sweet. Yeah, it's more of a sweet, like, brand mm -hmm. type shit. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, it's not bad. Now you said that's a big blunt. What size? Do you, do you think that's too big? Is that a t blunt too big for you? Like, you're normal it's every day? It's never too big. Every man's favorite word, Jay. <laughs> so. <laughs> what is he just <laughs> So, <laughs> well, how do you? How big are your L's that you roll? Like on a hill? Mm. How much? Would you, you put, say like? How much would you say you put in a good wood or blunt? If it's the first day I cop up, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna roll like a big joint, like a like a nice little like Gorilla Finger type joint. Mm. But if this like a struggle week, then I'm yes. gonna struggle L. <laughs> <laughs> do you struggle hate? L. Do you hate people that like join the ciphers with struggle L? Um, yeah, especially when they know it's like, like, you gotta be like him, like we're like we're cool, so mm -hmm. like he could do that. But like, if it's somebody like random, like if he was to bring somebody, then like no, mm -hmm. it's not. So you gotta what you more call it? Like I feel like with that type of situation, I feel like everybody's been there before. So like me, I'm more of a, you know, sympathetic or empathetic person. You know what I'm saying so. I really don't be minding. Especially if I gotta make myself personally, I'm not gonna mind it for me saying. So So you get your weed smoked up. Yeah, I ain't around people twenty four seven for nobody to smoke my weed up, so that's out. <laughs> How do you guys feel about what he said? How do you guys feel about roach weed? Oh, that's out. That's 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 down bad. That's no no weed, no money. <laughs> nobody to get nobody from that's a bad situation. Roach weed is bad. And I feel like that's that's kid shit. Like I ain't do that shit sound for young boy. Like 
That's really dangerous. Beginner shit. Yeah, like beginner smoker shit type. I mean. Yeah. yeah. What if somebody came up in the cypher and was like, yo, bro, I got a blunt, but it's a roach bud. Not in the cypher. Not in the cypher? Has that ever happened before? <laughs> yes. No, that, that, that <laughs> yeah, happened to me before. Weird shit like that all the time. So. No, 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 that ain't happened to me before, no. A grand full of roaches. You like, what, bro? You had a lot of them bitches. Yeah. <laughs> but no, like, if it's me, then, like, I might, like, I might pull one. Yeah. I might. It's <laughs> like at home shit. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's like some bomb oh, yeah, sauce so shit. Like, you're or by if, yourself, you crack. Yeah, or if I'm, like, with, like, like, my good friend or something, then, then maybe I'll do it. But, you know, I'm not Remember. bringing no roach out in the cypher, no. Yeah, <laughs> So what was the best weed that you've ever smoked in your opinion? I think I think that one. Me personally, <laughs> the best weed I've ever smoked, like name brand weed type shit was Gary Payton. That was the That's a good joint. best weed I personally That's smoked. That's a recent type of weed. That's like the, uh, a few years. Cause they, had, they had some of the Gary Payton in a, in a, in a, in a bum feed, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, but... That Gary Pizzle was is a good string. I ain't for a lot of time. Come on, Shilly. You um, gotta think about it for a second. Yeah, I do gotta think. Oh shit, I keep on the mic. But um, you said the you, the best weed that you smoked in your opinion. Um, that you <coughs> I'm not good with names, but I remember like I, I remember what it looked like. <coughs> um, it was like. It was it was it was lighter than this, and it had like that icy look to it, like. Mm, that cross white. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was like it was some kind of like Bubba Kush or like Granddaddy Kush, some mm. some shit like that. I can't remember, but. Okay. Probably something like that. Right, something. We're like a quarter way into this blunt. How you guys feel about it right now? That's a quarter. That's a quarter. Quarter way into it. I feel like we ain't make a dent. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Nah, you gotta be right. That was first. That was first quarter. Second quarter now. Yep. We ain't at halftime yet. We getting just about there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we could make it. Shit. <laughs> yeah, definitely feel we good smokes. It gets you fry for sure. Right. So, do you remember your first time smoking? <coughs> yes, that was a traumatic experience. <coughs> I was so high, bro. I felt like I was so high. I felt like like this. I just like I just kept feeling like that. I couldn't walk straight. I couldn't do nothing. So I got like sober, bro. I was scared. I'm, I was by myself. I was like, damn. Yeah. It was a terrible experience. My How first time smoking. I was about like 15, mm, okay. 14, 15, one of those two. Have you been smoking ever since? Not ever since, on and off though, for sure. Okay. Mm. My first time smoking, I think I was with my homegirl at the time. And it was like an after school type joint. So we snuck up. We we went to this um I forgot where it is, but um it's like it's like close to the school. It's not on school grounds, but it's close to the um the high school. Um no, it's by Mexburg Oven. Okay. Yeah. So um so yeah, she had her little um she I'll never forget. She had this this pipe jaw, but it was made out of a um, it was made out of a bamboo stick, and she made it herself. And she was like, she was like, yeah, we bought a. <laughs> she packed that jaw, and, and yeah, she had to teach me how to like inhale and shit. Like it was it was nice. Yeah. I was on my ass. I'm not gonna lie. I was on my ass. How many hits you think you took? Um, how many I could take? I don't know. I think we finished like two, like like two bowls, like me and her. Wow, so. first timer. Yeah. That's so like that was, walk home was kind of first time smoking with a bowl. That is heavy. That's that's right. pushing this. Yeah. So yeah, I, I still I still don't know what I don't even know if I consider it a bong though, because it was it was just a piece of bamboo with a with a thing in it. Yeah, so like. Shit. Yeah. She, she was, was sturdy with it though. I ain't gonna lie. She was smoking. She was sturdy. Yeah. She was <laughs> some hippie shit. Right. I ain't gonna say her name, but you know who you are. Sure. Right. All right, well, <laughs> since we're on that topic, cool. Name somebody that you would want to smoke with before you die. Liz Khalifa. Why? That's my guy. That's your guy? You fuck with his music? Mm -hmm. Okay. 
I would say probably Kodak Black because that nigga is funny as shit. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, like that'd be like a good experience. Like he cool as shit, like personality wise, like he ain't gonna be over tough. He's definitely gonna be funny as shit. So <coughs> for me to be at for sure. <coughs> Or like Seth Rogen or some shit. Seth Rogen. Seth I was waiting for somebody like that. To come no, up. I need. Nah, that's he's... different though. Yeah, yeah. Seth Rogen. I was waiting that's for somebody like that to pop up. Yeah. That's how you. You think you can outsmoke Seth? Adam Sandler would be cool as shit to smoke. Yeah. What is your celebrity? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Smoke a cipher. You only pick three. Oh, celebrities. just three people. That you can smoke with. And a cipher. <clears throat> Mm. I was about to, mainly celebrities that you know that smoke. I feel like we got two from her. We need one more. Yeah. All right, so I would say if it, a cipher, I can pick any three. I'll pick Kodak Black for sure. Mm -hmm. I'll probably smoke with Drake. Kodak, Drake, and <coughs> just to like, I don't even see, I don't even know female artists that smoke, so I can't even be like, damn, just to throw a female in there. So, the hell. And Adam Sandler, for sure, that'd be a good sight. We'd be big. <laughs> <laughs> be no, that'd be, that'd be crazy. Yeah. Um, for sure. So was it two I said? I said Seth Rogen. Mm -hmm. And then, what did I say? Oh, I said Wiz. Mm -hmm. And then, um, uh, I don't know why I see his face in my brain. I can't remember. Oh, Cheeky. Oh, I right. see that. Yeah, you got a good sight. <laughs> so only reason I ain't say Snoop because I feel like he's gonna be a critic. Cheeky, cheeky. Like, yeah. Yeah. No, Snoop, bro, no, oh my Snoop god. Gonna be, no. I feel like he's gonna Snoop critique gonna everything. Though. But he's an uncle. Smoking. He's more like a uh, like, he's, he's more like a he's more like a teacher shit. type John. Like, yeah, I feel like I'm like, learning too much. I'm trying to just get high. I'm not trying to learn yeah. cannabisology. Yeah. <laughs> but you know Wiz only smoked papers. You cool with that? Yeah. He taught me how to roll over. Really? Oh, you watched his YouTube back in the day? Yeah, um, his uh his day to days. Mm-hmm. And he had the W joint with the, mm -hmm. with the thing. Ouch. I tried this, I couldn't do it. Damn, so he put his arm on that the, joint. The paper? Yeah, like he he did the W on the filter thing. I, yeah, they probably But it's the other way. Tested. That way is really easy, but it's another way with the I think I showed you before. The joint with the um it's like a little I can't explain it. I can't explain it. I can only show you, but like so I can't explain I it. Got, see, like see. like it's a like you, you supposed to like basically clone it and then like stuff it in a way to where it got like this little thing hanging out, but it's like it has a perfect edge, mm -hmm. and then you you burn the edge and then you take it off and then you hit it. Mm -hmm. I'm like I'm sturdy with sorry, that drum. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I will to my own horn. I could. I, yeah. <laughs> Weed, oh, like a strain? Yeah, a yeah. strain of weed. Uh, that you have it too. If, you, if you could find this, you would grab it and smoke it. What, what strain is I that? I guess KK. I've heard of it. I can't mm -hmm. remember what it is. I'm not trying to bring him up again, but that's Wiz Khalifa strain. Oh, okay. A, chemi <laughs> a, a chemist made it for him. So okay. Like, mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know. See, me, I would probably go for like. One of the one of the one of the highest like gumbos, like mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Like one of the most top shelf gumbo. I don't even know the, like what name to call it, but I know it'll definitely be out of the gumbo strain. Yeah, so for strange. sure. Okay. I've heard of gumbo, but heard that's a serious one. Bro, every L mm -hmm. like Do you think you're more of a sativa smoker or indica smoker? Which one appeals to you? I ain't gonna lie. Or you don't care? I guess I'm a junkie smoker. Yeah, I'm about to say, like, I honestly, I really don't. Because honestly, I don't be knowing what it, what, what it, like, what I'm grabbing hard. This is da da da. This is da da da. I don't be knowing. I'd be like, all right, this is your gas. This is your sticky icky. Right. And I'm, 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 I'm fried. Like, I don't be knowing the difference. So I guess I'm just a weed junkie. Like, okay. I have no preference. Well, I mean, like, I, um, I mean, like, if I'm 
if I need like sleep, then like end of it. But if I'm just smoking, I like a hybrid because basically like the street weeds that we be getting, they're, they're basically hybrids anyway. So that's what I'm used to. Okay. Sativa doesn't really like do much for me. Okay. So you like more of a, a head high or a body high? A little bit of both. That's that's why I like hybrids. Okay. Mm -hmm. I feel like head highs put me down though. Like, okay, what's the uh, best time to smoke for you guys? Best time for me, definitely before work, and definitely after work. <coughs> but like, I have weed so much that I don't be caring to smoke. Like, I'll have weed and just not smoke. Like, mm -hmm. I don't know if that makes sense. But yeah, that makes sense. That's the that type of shit that I be on. I just gotta be in the mood to smoke. Okay. Do you think smoking before work makes you? work better? Not make me work better, but it definitely puts me in a better mood. Like, Cause I work with people all day, so I'm definitely def uh, dealing with different egos any given second, you feel what I'm saying? So like, I have to be professional at any given moment. So I feel like if I smoke, it's definitely gonna have me at calm. It's not gonna be like, this person is acting like a street person. They're not no street person. Mm -hmm. Just chill. You right. know what I mean? They frustrated about their damn phone. <laughs> <laughs> but with that being said, do you think weed really impairs your day-to-day -day activities? It don't impair it. It enhances it. Like such as driving? It enhances it. It makes it your experience better. Mm -hmm. Like, I can't explain it, but if you, you, if you smoke, you know, like, Anything you do when you high is the experience is better, like should be brighter, everything like I can't <laughs> The birds be chirping louder. Bro, you get everything <laughs> more aware. Yeah, like seriously. Like, like not even on the joking shit, but seriously though, like when you when you fry you be more mm. in tune with the environment and shit like that. Okay. Yeah. I was wondering like, cause you know how the government always says like in fact, if you look on that uh, jar right there, read the warning label to tell you driving under the influence. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So I always like to get people's opinion on that. Like, how do you feel about that? Like, that's some, do you think it's bullshit? Yeah, I think about it. people do it every day. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So it's always like uh, that's how they say uh, everything. <coughs> all the all the good stuff you do, people are not gonna bring it up, but. The bad stuff is going, is going, is going outlast mm -hmm. all the good you do did. You feel like what I'm that. saying? So I feel like that's that's the big cliche on weed as well. Like, what's the little dumb shit that do that people do, happen to do off of weed? Like, so. definitely. It looks like y'all in the fourth quarter right now on that blunt. Mm -hmm. How y'all feeling about it right now? Like, fried? Pretty good. Fried. I'm chilling, mellow, <laughs> relaxed. Mm, cut it up. I'm good. Okay. Yeah. You start laughing, it's working. <laughs> I'm like this naturally. So when you smoke, do you really get the munchies all crazy or no? Yes. I get the munchies. What's your go-to snack when you fry? You beautifuls. The nacho cheese door. Cracking it on the <laughs> what about you? Um, <clears throat> you just can't. gotta have it. <laughs> you can um the Doritos blue bed. Classic. Ooh, rich. <laughs> it's a whoa. <laughs> That's a good hit, hit, bro. Good hit. It's different. You shake them and then you turn them upside down and you pop them. That was some fat shit. Only way I eat them joints is if I eat them joints with the black, the black bag of uh, popcorn and the white cheddar. <laughs> joint. And you mix that's them together. Word. Yeah, from my mom to y'all, that's, that's a shot, bro. The cool ranch joints with the with the with, with the white cheddar, the black. It gotta be the black <laughs> bag. I'm dead. It gotta be the black bag. That's different. You put them joints together, you like die on these joints. Oh, Fussing out the bed though. Oh my god. <laughs> so, All right. what's your favorite kind of movie to watch when you're high? Um, like any comedy movie. Any comedy? Mm -hmm. uh, for me, I like to watch action shit. I like to be 
Damn, you just yeah, 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 I like the be a bitch. Yeah, I like action drawn, I like I like I like gangster drawings, like I like shit that I feel like I can relate to or I feel like this shit makes sense, like you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I, I'm not gonna uh bash the uh fantasy drawings, but I'm definitely an action movie one fry. I wanna see some action. Okay. Some shooting and shit. Some niggas get some money. Okay. Some fry. What's the hottest action movie you've seen lately? The hottest action movie I've seen, uh, I just watched, recently, I just watched The uh, the Old Guard. I think that's been on Netflix, The Old Guard. It's like four, it's like four, uh, like, spec, spec out people and shit. Like, they get, they get that joint pop. I forgot uh, the whole plot and all that. I ain't gonna say I'm mm -hmm. right to no story, but that joint is the recent joint I've just seen that just pop. Okay. What's the funniest thing you've seen lately like, that you was high watching? Or a better question, you said comedy stuff, right? Mm -hmm. Who in comedy makes you laugh the most right now? Mm -hmm. Like, who's your go-to comedy guy? That's a really good question. Because <coughs> I have, like, a lot of them. Yeah. Like, I mean, um, I guess I'll just be a cliche. Like, I guess, like, Kevin Hart. Like early Kevin Hart. Oh. Okay. I'm not good with like loaded questions like on the spot. So like okay. you had me there. Like I was gonna be thinking like all day. Okay. I don't think somebody like Cat Williams. Tony That's what I'm about to say. That was my Williams. second guess though. Oh, that was God. funny. Tony Baker. See, I thought that I was say, funny. See me like I'm thinking Tony comedy, Baker. Wait, you said I'm Tony like Baker. Harlem Knights type yeah, he's funny. Mm. No, Bo the dead. Mm -hmm. Bo the dead. Yeah, well, he's definitely Friday. I ain't gonna lie. Friday, 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 I ain't gonna like he said, like, I feel like he's, like, trying too hard now. Like, he yells too much. And like, he's before, just sweaty. Yeah, like, before and he looks it was messy funny now. as hell. Yeah. Okay. But, like, I used to watch uh, Dave Chappelle a lot. Mm. He funny as shit, too, though. Mm. Right. Give me the top yeah. three comedians real quick. You may see me or you ain't not. Oh, me, I would three. say uh, Eddie Murphy. I say Eddie Murphy. Uh... What's that black boy that uh played with him in uh, Coming to America? He funny as shit. Uh, to Arsenio Hall, oh my fucking god, <laughs> them niggas are stupid, bro. So and then I would say uh the uh who the dude from uh, Harlem Nights? The, uh, the he was he was like the boss boy, the the fro. Yeah, Richard Pryor. Oh, yeah. That's my top three. God damn, you gonna be crying. <laughs> <laughs> That's a crazy lineup. <laughs> um, I guess uh, for me, uh, Eddie Murphy, Dave Chappelle, mm -hmm. and um, uh, I can't remember his name. Damn. Should I describe what, what movie he played? <coughs> I can't think of the movie. The weed, bro. Huh? The weed. <laughs> Y'all gonna stop coming for me, man. I'm gonna take another shot. It's probably be my birthday shot. Take a birthday shot. Definitely oh take God. another shot. When you don't let me shot you. You let me smoke alone. You it's about to shot sting. She's oh, <laughs> about to sting the quavo. Yeah. <laughs> that shit don't play, though. Ay, 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 ay. Bullshit. <laughs> Are you more of a drinker or a smoker? Smoker, but I like I like to do both. I like to <coughs> I like to smoke and drink as a collective. Okay. Yeah, like if I'm gonna drink, like I have to smoke. Damn, you just took God damn. My oh, man. <laughs> overall, since the hell is almost gone, how y'all feel? Uh, One out of ten. I'm nice. I feel nice. I'm 
I'm still at that seven and a half, eight mark. I ain't okay. I'm budging mark. off that. That's a good mark. What do you rate it? One out of ten. Especially if it was in the wood. Yeah, that, 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 that was in the wood. Was crazy. In the wood, it was smack different. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. I appreciate y'all popping out, man. Giving us an honest review. Thank you for South Duke Cloud Nine Studios, man. We'll see y'all on the next episode. Say y'all name again. Let them know where to find y'all. You can find me on the Instagram, K. Benson. <coughs> Uh, who is Nisha on Instagram? Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. Thank y'all for stopping out. Like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. Peace.